Day of Dignity is a day where students and teachers come together here in Grand Erie to really explore what dignity means. And it's a conference we've been running for a number of years, so we have some kids who are back uh, time after time after time. One of the things that we always ask them to do is think about how they can act with dignity for their whole school and ways that they can help the school act with dignity for all of the students who are learning there. This is important because Grand Erie is committed to equity and inclusive education. We're committed to safe and, and engaging environments and this really values the student voice. I think because it values the student voice so much, they take it really seriously and because their voice is on the line and they care so much about what happens in their schools, their actions really, really are multiplied. They, they do such a great job planning the stuff that they're going to do with their, with their school communities and I think that's where the real importance is. It's, it's because it's their voice, their action for their community. I chose to be here because when I get into the older grades, I would like to be like a leader in the school. So I thought this would help with it. We're definitely gonna definitely brainstorm when we get back yeah, to exactly. different ways of like this, making a like, difference in the community and stuff Yeah, like this that. is a really good experience to take and then go back to our Dignity Club and tell them what we learned and start like bring more of it to that. Yeah. So. We're learning to like really include people and not leave people out. Like when you're doing an activity, include everybody. Don't like make a group of five if there's like seven people. We talked about like not judging people like a lot and how people should be treated fairly more to equal because mm -hmm. there's so many people out there that um, like we're all different. We're not the same. Yeah. So like sometimes you need to think about fairness more than you need to do for equal a lot of accepting people. I think that I would like to implement like not leaving people like in our school some people like we're sort of in like cliques so it's like different groups. I think it'd be cool if like we were all just one big group. Between the first conference now and then the second one in the spring, the schools go away and do all of their planning and put together their programs and run all kinds of activities for the students and schools. And uh, when they come back in the spring, they report on that. And it's really a fabulous celebration in the spring to see all of the great things that the kids have done. Um, the students grow a lot over the course of that year. They're getting um, the seeds of knowledge today. And by the time they come back in the spring, we have full-fledged flowers blooming great stories of dignity.